Is your mouth tingling? Hello, sirs and madams. We are here on vacation again. <laughs> it's Paul's funny voice. And we are in... Vegas. <laughs> we're in Las Vegas. Yes. <laughs> but we're in the Venetian. Yes, we are. We're in our sweet Swede. Yes, I did a, a sweet tour already. Uh, sure. But we are in our living room of our suite. We just had breakfast, coffee. And beignets. Well, did you eat it? I had a beignet. It's a... And a croissant. It's a whole thing. Paul had a chocolate croissant. I had a strawberry croissant, which is basically just a croissant with strawberries in it. And crumblies. And crumblies. There were crumblies on top of it. And then half a macaron. There's another one in there that they gave us for free. I don't know if you can see it. There it is. That They're gigantic. That was very nice of them. Very kind of the staff here at the Venetian. I think it was a mistake, but yes. <laughs> very kind. So what's the plan for today? We're going to party. We're going to gamble. We're going to eat. And then we're going to see Ka, Ka at the Mirage. Is it at the Mirage? No, I don't think it's at the Mirage. I think it's at the MGM. It's at the MGM Grand. <laughs> it will be grand, I promise you that. Are you going to do this accent the whole trip? <laughs> no. <laughs> just right now. Just right now or every time I turn on the camera? Just to begin the day. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, we're going to go to Cosmopolitan today and get drinks at the Chandelier Bar, which I am bringing the camera for, even though you're going to hate me for carrying on this gigantic camera. You can carry whatever you'd like. And um, then we're going to have brunch at the Wicked Spoon, not brunch, lunch at the Wicked Spoon, the buffet there. Then we're going to probably gamble before that, because we'll probably be so full we don't want to move after that. And then we'll probably Uber it back to the Venetian, hang out here until the show tonight. And that is the plan. I'm sitting in my underwear right now. I just thought you all over the place. In case you want to know that. You know that. <laughs> yes. Are you? Well, yeah, you are. No, I definitely <laughs> am. I'm not. But it's going to be 85 <laughs> degrees today, so there'll be a lot of time spent in my underwear. Will you wear a dress? <laughs> You're not going outside in your underwear. <laughs> Maybe I will. We're on vacation. What happens in Vegas? <laughs> what happens in what Vegas? What happens in Vegas? Yeah. What are we doing? We're waiting for a taxi. No, oh, we're waiting for an Uber. We're waiting for Chester. Chester, our Uber driver. The um, casinos here each have their own area for Uber and Lyft. You know, if you so if you're picking up Uber and Lyft, you pick it up right here. Head to the Cosmo. I'm gonna have to speed that bit up so you can't even hear that. Well, then you're gonna miss the best part. Maybe I'll just uh, I'll speed up after you're done singing. Come okay. in. Okay, I'm videoing. <laughs> you're funny. Cosmo has all these pictures of like old Vegas slot machine underwater. Old blue eyes. All right, we're coming up on the chandelier bar. 
it is inside of the chandelier. Verbena, which is on a special menu, Verbena. which is like you don't get to see it. So that's what called. We'll let you know when they come out. So this is the Verbena. What is that flower? It's a Szechuan button. Szechuan button. So what you're supposed to do is try the drink first, and then eat the flower, and then. Um, it makes your mouth tingly and then you finish the drink another time. So we're going to try it. I'm going to try the drink first. It's like, I don't know, lemony? Now, I'm going to eat the flower and swish around my mouth for 30 seconds and swallow. All right. Taste. Is your mouth tingling? Because they said your mouth would tingle. It's tingling? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's a weird feeling. Is it like pop rocks or like what kind of tingle? I don't know. It's making my saliva go. Uh oh. Alright, drink up. Like what? Come on, you gotta explain it. I don't it. know how to explain it. Like, it's like your mouth is burning without the heat. It's like a feeling of, of like stinging. It's like stinging. I mean, not painful stinging, I'm just like drooling everywhere. It's very strange. You can try it next. Alright. Well, hopefully I'll be able to find the words to explain it, because you have not. We'll see. Go ahead, try it. Only one way to find out, ladies and germs. <laughs> the drink itself tastes like lemonade. Do I have to eat the stem and everything? Yeah, everything. I feel like I ate a handful of grass and now my tongue is swelling up. <laughs> like I just ate something very sour. It's kind of weird. It's almost like my my tongue is salivating yeah. as I speak. Coming from your tongue? Yeah. 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 My tongue feels like a gigantic lemon right now. When you squeeze it on the lemon. Yep. I, I, know, it's weird. It's I know, it's very difficult to explain. It's a sensation. I feel like people need to come here and try it just because it's something interesting, but I'm not sure I would get it again. Yeah, it's a novelty. Yeah, all right. Not a go-to. Not a go-to. So we're gonna finish, I think we should finish this before we drink this. Wait till our mouths deem numb. <laughs> Alright, we'll see you in a minute. Even though pa Paul's mouth might still be numb from that flower, he's gonna try his drink. Queen of Hearts. Ready to show on the road. Uh, a little bit of thickness, it looks like a glass 
It's because it has egg whites in it. It's a lot more comfortable. Yeah. It down a lot easier. Better? Yeah. Now my mouth is almost completely better because I had the thing first, but. Like very it, slight fizz. It does have the, the cucumber y taste. It's smooth. Where are we? We're at the wooden spoon. Wicked spoon buffet. Is it the wooden or wicked? Wicked. Oh. It's through those orange walls. But unfortunately, we're waiting online. The trick for these buffets is to come in while it is still brunch time because it's cheaper and then stay until they change it over to dinner where it's more expensive. We have just gotten back from the Wicked Spoon Buffet and I'm basically in a food coma. It was so good. Lots of crab legs and desserts. Um, I'm back in the room, relaxing. Paul's downstairs gambling. And then we have Ka at 7 tonight at MGM? I'm not sure. So I'm just relaxing for like an hour before we have to go and do that. And um, I'm probably not going to bring the camera because you definitely cannot film in there. So this might be it for tonight. Or when we come back, maybe we'll head to the casino. Um, I'll take the camera, I guess. Why not? And I'll, uh, I'll see you then.